What's up, coding fans? Here we are. We've got another small map. Uh, we're looking, all right, so that's zero, zero. So it's three columns wide by four columns tall. All right, now we're going to mess with our um, array a little bit. Uh, but if we're looking at this stuff, like we've got foods where everything in here is a food. Um, and we can remove things and stuff like that. So, um, but if you notice everything in this array variable, the, in the example, it's all foods. So here we've got an array called characters. And in there we've got blue, we've got the color pink portal, we've got hopper, and we have a gem. So honestly, if I were realistically looking at this, I'd say, well, this seems ridiculous. This array is just a terrible array. Um, but that's not what we're really looking at doing. We are looking at editing the array outside of the array or in the code, okay? Um, I'm gonna go ahead and run this so that we can kind of see what's up. All right, there's blue, there's the portal. All right, so that's what we got. So blue's here at space zero. Um, the pink portal's here at space one. The or hopper is there at space three, and the gym is there at space four. Okay, so remember when we're dealing with this, we're not when we're iterating over the the array, it starts counting at zero. So zero one. So despite the, the fact that they are four things, they are at positions zero, one, two, and three. All right. So let's. Look at this, it says remove the portal. And we are removing the portal not from the world. So it's not world dot, we're removing the portal from the, away, from the array. So let's start there. So we find our array name, characters dot. And then we want to remove, okay? Now we could remove all, we can remove first, we can remove last. We just wanna remove at a certain spot. Okay, so I'm removing the portal and the portal is at spot one, so zero, one, all right? So we go ahead and run this and we'll kind of see what's up. And you'll notice the portal is gone, but now we've got to reference what's going on because now that pink portal is not there anymore. So now it goes character blue is one, character hopper is two, and Jim is three. Okay, so the gem is the third thing here. So we're gonna remove the gem from our array. So back here, characters dot. And then we're gonna remove at, okay. And we're removing at zero, one, two. So we're removing at two. That should remove our gem. And there we go. Next thing we need to do is insert the expert, and the expert is a little bit taller than blue and a little bit shorter than hopper. So we're gonna insert the expert right at the, se at the second um, place, or he's going to be second, which is at position one. Because blue is at zero, then we're gonna need to put the expert at one, and then hopper will then be moved to two. So we're doing this once again in our characters array. So characters dot, And then here we're going to insert, and we're going to insert capital expert with parentheses, all right, at position number one, so that he'll be second in this line. All right, we'll go ahead and run our code. There we go, okay? So we got lots of options to go, and man, they do look close. Blue and Hopper look pretty close, or excuse me, blue and the expert. All right, so that's how we do it. It does get confusing when we're talking about removing at one, removing at two, and then placing at one, but it's just the way it works out because we are messing with our array in the code below it. All right, see you on the next one.